So StatSports are one of the main GPS providers around the world. Right now they provide GPS units to our national teams, youth national teams, the NWSL and then also the development academies. For the women's national team has been that the NWSL have, have worn uh, the units for, for the last few years. And for us with a national team that means that pretty much we're tracking our players every stage of the year because we have access to the data when they're with the NWSL clubs and we also obviously have access with the data to the data when they come in with us at the national team. So we can make sure on a on a week to week basis the players are being developed optimally without being pushed towards fatigue, injury risk and so on. So it just means for the players it's it's just a more streamlined preparation to maximise their output and also minimise injury risk and ultimately maximise their availability to play because again if you maximise player availability you're going to get your best players on the field and there's a great chance of success. With any GPS system it turns out 200-300 metrics so Part of the whole process is really fine-tuning what are the key metrics important for you as a practitioner, for the players, but then also for the coaches and their style of play. Our players need to be doing a lot of max sprints, a lot of high-speed work. So right now, some of the key focus is the amount of high-speed running players are doing, number of max sprints, the ability to repeat those sprints with minimal recovery. We know in a game how much high-speed running or high intensity work we want a player to do, okay, can we then design a training program so the players are hitting that in their training so that they're over prepared for anything they might have to face in a game.